Hi viewers, I've been doing some other experimenting today and I finally destroyed this device. Um, I think this multi electrode uh, high voltage transformer is burnt out. Went with fizzle while I was experimenting with my uh, new ZVS setup with a rotary spark gap. I was going on 36 volts. But before this, I need to have a quick shout. Um, one of my new subscribers, Australians Tig. Um, I'll put a link in and he's new on YouTube and puts on, does also electrical experiments and of course high voltage rules. He is the source behind my ZVS experimentals and um, yeah this is quite uh, cool actually. I've made this simple rotary spark gap from a uh, 24 volt motor. Let's I'm using this flyback. Current is about uh, 6 ampere, 24 volts. It's going to turn the lights up to. Uh, to This thing on top is a Tesla transformer which I built about 25 years ago but I never used it and I found it again uh, in the attic and um, basically it's not wired up correctly I put the HV uh, from the flyback into the primary coil which is um, the, the coil around and then the HV is jumped up to the stem it's got about two three hundred turns up to the end part which I've a glass uh, container which has uh, aluminium foil and I can create a little bit of corona and it looks quite cool so we're going to activate it shortly Front video cameras usually struggle getting some of these colors so nice. I'll turn the light up shortly. Try a little bit from here, not sure I want to do that. Yeah, this is the motor from a computer or no, from a um, photocopier. I do apologize, the audio is not as good when the motor is running, um, especially when the spark gap is under load because it uh, seems to interfere quite a bit. Uh, so uh, I'll try to put some subtitles in this particular setup. Movie. The Tobias just woken up. Toby! This is the schematic I used here. 
um, yeah, flyback and then the coal series spark gap and a chicken stick.